Well, hey everyone, it's Pelican Tacos here. Let's talk about pie. Do you like pie? I like pie. You know, might be thinking, hmm, lemon meringue, or cherry, or pecan, or is it pecan? Rhubarb. Who, who eats rhubarb? But you know my favorite? Pumpkin pie. Yeah. All right, well, let's talk about pie. No, the math kind of pie. You might be thinking, hey, you know what? Today's pie day, and I want to learn about pie. And maybe about Minecraft. So let's talk about it. Ready? All right, well, mathematicians dream about it all day long, and they wish they could eat it all year long. It's 3.14159265395, and a few more numbers. You know, my school did something really cool for Pi Day this year, and they decorated the hallways with pie. They took over 800 digits of pie and put them on the walls. And when I walked out of school with my seven-year-old, she said, is this a really big number, Daddy? I said, no, it's not that big. It's actually just a little bit bigger than three. And she said, well, Daddy, it's gigantulish. And I said, what, what are you talking about? That's not even a word. Maybe you mean ginormous? No, Dad, that's not a word. All right, so we had a conversation about pi in the hallway with my seven-year-old, and it was awesome. 3.14. Now, they had over 800 digits put up on all the walls. And you think about pi. Why? Hmm. Why? Pi. Well, it's really just a little bit bigger than three. You know, four could crush it. It's bigger than that. Well, why do we study pi? You know what? It actually all started with the pyramids. The Pyramid of Giza. A long, long time ago. Oh, maybe 4,000 years ago. When they were building the pyramids, they knew about pi. And they thought, hmm, let's build our pyramid around pi. Let's do it. Well, you know what the funny thing is? Is the perimeter, which is the distance all the way around the pyramid here in this blue line, is 1,760 cubits. Just a little bit bigger than a square bit. <laughs> and the height's about 280 bits, which is this guy right inside here, this red pole. That is 280 cubits. Well, you put those two numbers together, and you know what you get? Two pies, 6.2832. So when we talk about pi, we're talking about a specific number, 3.14. Well, someday, a little bit after the pyramids, this Greek dude in Archimedes came up with an approximation for the perimeter of circle. He said, you know what? What happens if I take a whole bunch of polygons? Remember what a polygon is? A whole bunch of shapes, put them inside, and make them have a little bit more sides than the previous one. And what will we end up with? something like this, a circle. Now, we could approximate that by going around and measuring the edges. Well, here you have about 85 blocks around the outside that represent the circumference here that's purple. And the yellow is the diameter. Well, you know what? When you put those two numbers together, you take the diameter, which is yellow, and the circumference, which is purple, you put them together, you divide them out, he came up with 3.1408 which is pretty dang close. Because pi, as we know today, is 3.14159265359 and so forth. He was pretty accurate. Archimedes, this Greek dead dude, was very accurate up until about 70 thousandths. That's pretty crazy. That's just a little bit, isn't it? If we were talking in meters, that's about the thickness of seven human hairs. Well, if you look at my hair, definitely not that much. <laughs> well, so if you find yourself a circle, it can be any circle. Let's find the circle in Minecraft. You know, in Minecraft, they're actually kind of hard to come by. Everything's made out of squares. But if we take this diameter here, the yellow, which here, it's 31 blocks. The yellow diameter is 31. And the circumference, the purple here, the purple circumference is 85. We compare them up. We divide them out. Now, you know what? This is Minecraft. We get 2.8. Not quite. Well, if we look at the other one with the pyramids, and we take the circumference here of the blue, which is about 280 blocks, and we divide it by the diameter, which is about 100 blocks, you know what we get? 2.8. Looks like pi in Minecraft is about 2.8, not 3.14. I guess that's what you get when you're building with blocks and squares, huh? Well, this is Pelican Tacos, and here's to Pie Day and Minecraft math and eating some pumpkin pie. Why don't you do it? 
Let the mathematician you love indulge themselves today and talk about pie all day long. And maybe even serve them up a piece of pie too. Who knows? They might even let you eat a piece too. Serve them up 3.14 pieces and I bet they'll give you the rest.